Well guys, it is a beautiful, absolutely gorgeous Tuesday. It's Tuesday. I had to think of what day it was. Tuesday evening, the sun is setting behind me, so I'm losing time. But it's like 60 degrees out, so I gotta get this lawn swept quick. Come join us, won't you? <laughs> so I got my tractor out, and boy does it need washed, it's dirty. Uh, I have the sweeper hooked up to it. Uh, very simple, just pull the pin. Uh, these actually will help adjust the height. Um, it's set for being at the top at 10 inches, since this is about 9 inches, I have a spacer below and a spacer above. That helps uh, set everything. Uh, one more thing you may need to know, if you're watching this as a honest review. Setting the height, very simple. You just pull this forward till the height you need. And then tighten this uh, wing nut, and that's how you set your height. Uh, you can tell there's already leaves in there, and that's just from me pulling it out of the garage. Uh, so you can definitely see the path I took is fairly clean. Uh, I may need to adjust the height once I get to the grass. I don't know yet. No. I'm going to do my best to do an honest review and show you how it works. It's going to be hard because really to do a good review, I would need another person kind of filming me as I do this. So it's going to be hard for me to show you how it's working and vlog at the same time because there's only one of me, Kristen's at work. But I'll do my best. So let's go try it out. So it's fairly obvious where I went through right here. Now, not such great results, but that could be because of the height setting. And it was pretty thick. If you look in here, I did collect quite a bit of leaves, which I think if I adjust the height setting a little bit and try it again, we it may take two or three times to adjust the height. Uh, we'll find out. But yeah, that look at all the leaves I don't have to pick up by hand. Okay. So a little bit of beginner's issues here. Just not fully understanding you know, how much I could pick up, how much it picks up, how fast I could go. You can tell I'm just randomly driving around in my yard. You can tell it does pretty good but it gets super full super fast. Now my leaves are really thick, uh, but if I were out here every day doing this, or you know, even once a week, not like once every three months, this would go a lot better. The other problem is I haven't mastered backing up with this yet. It likes to uh, fishtail when I back up. I don't know the exact, uh, jackknife is the exact word I'm looking for. Uh, so learning curve, but it's doing okay, like I said. You can tell where I just randomly drove, it's picking up. Now they got the height set right. Uh, emptying it, very simple. I'll show you that here in a minute, in fact. Okay, I'm starting to lose light, but I think I figured out generally how to do this. Number one, your leaves can't be super thick. Uh, like this is way too thick. Uh, I gotta go over it like three times before it turns into this. Now this is working really well. Uh, another thing is, you really have to plan out how you're going to do your leaves because wherever you're dumping this it has to be clear enough that it's not jamming up all the tires and getting all this in front of it. So what I've been doing, and I will show you this another day, is dumping them using the blades to cut them up and to shoot them into the woods and that gives a nice clear path to keep dragging this behind. Uh, I do apologize. This isn't really turning out to be the video I wanted it to be, but it is a great learning exercise for me uh, on how to be doing this. So when I do do a full good review of this product, uh, the sweeper, uh, it'll actually make sense. So yeah, I know these are kind of boring vlogs, uh, but you know, I'm trying to uh, A, get stuff done around the house, which I need to learn how to use this. B put some videos out there that I know will actually make some money and uh, review videos and uh, assembly videos how to videos make money and see am I on C I don't know uh, I got nothing else uh, I'll just talk to you later okay not impressed at all uh, now it did do the yard I mean the yards fairly clean it took a long time to get it that way low uh, I don't know if I saved any time by using the sweeper. Here's the other problem. Up here, where the leaves are really heavy, it, 
didn't do anything. In fact, you can see here where the tires actually stopped spinning on it and it was just kind of pulling through the grass, leaving rivets in my grass. Uh, so this, I kind of all have to do by hand or I have to blow it out here more where the vacuum will actually pick it up. So um, I know there's still a learning curve. Uh, it doesn't reverse very well at all. I want to jackknife all the time. That may be me. That may actually be, uh, you know, it. I'm not sure. I don't want to say either way because I, I don't know, honestly. But I'm just not impressed overall. Uh, I don't think the tires are the right kind of tires for that unit. I think it needs a little beefier tires. That way it could, like, continue to spin no matter... Like, the smallest little things seem to make the tire stop spinning. Uh, I don't know. I'm just, just not impressed. Uh, sorry, this review, uh, or fail of review, isn't that great? Uh, but hey, I'm trying something different, right? So chalk one up for experience. Say hi. Where you at? Come here. Say hi. Say hi to everybody. Say hi to everybody. Well, obviously, I am over my mom's taking care of Lacey and Peachy. Uh, just have Lacey up here giving her a good pet because she never gets pet if you ask her. She'll say she no one ever pets her. I think but all animals say that though. I figured I'd take a quick moment uh, to do my Thanksgiving giving thanks thankfulness thing. I really gotta figure that out, don't I? Uh, but some really good news that happened this week is as you know, Kristen's sister of uh, Julie and her husband Matt have been a foster parent to Des for over two years now and uh, so I'm really thankful that they decided to do that and they're fostering uh, Des and you know it's really cool they're doing that and the good news is they actually were able to adopt her yesterday so uh, Des is officially part of the family and you'll actually get to see her and I'll introduce you to her in a couple weeks when I go, well, Kristen and I go to Columbus for Julie's uh, Christmas party. So that would be exciting. Uh, yeah, but I'm really thankful for Des that she's a part of the family now. And thankful for Matt and Julie that uh, they decided that they wanted to do fostering. And uh, really helped change uh, Des's life. Uh, thumbs up to all of you guys. Uh, but I gotta go home now. And I'm not really going to do much the rest of the night. Uh, kind of still disappointed and just kind of like over uh that the craftsman uh lawn sweepers not working the way i wanted to i really do think it's more me than it uh so i just gotta keep practicing at it anyways i don't know why i keep going on about it i'm gonna go home and watch a little bit of tv and when kristen gets home and we're gonna eat some dinner and then go to bed uh so this is probably gonna be it uh but i will talk to you at home uh, real quick before i do end it well guys, as promised, I was talking to you again, uh, came home, ate another pepperoni roll. Them things are so good. I could eat one every single day of the week. Almost have, but they're, they're super good, so I don't mind. But it is time for me to get this edited, get this uploaded, so when Kristen comes home, we have some time to spend together, and just hang out and go to bed. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Have a good one.